Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Melissa. Happy birthday to you. Hey! Everybody wish Melissa a happy birthday in the comments below. I would really appreciate it. That is Dennis Turney Jr.'s wife. And today is her birthday. And you know, Dennis Turney told me that sometimes him and her, they play track by track watching me. And they play along with me. And these people are awesome. And, uh, you know, Dennis is a kiss dude. Melissa is a Fleetwood Mac girl. So Dennis asked me to do the Kiss Greatest Hits versus Melissa's Greatest Hits. I think it's called Best Of, the Kiss one, which I actually bought that album when it came out because it had the live version of Shout Out Loud. That's the only reason I, I bought it. I was such a dope. A lot of you were dopes as well. As silly as I was. But um, they both have 16 tracks. I believe it was 16 tracks. They both, so let's do this. By the way, I, I really like Fleetwood Mac too. I you know, I've seen Fleetwood Mac. I've seen Stevie Nicks front row. I'm a fan. So it's a good fight, this one. Believe it or not. Uh, started off with Rihanna versus Detroit Rock City. I got to go with Detroit Rock City. I love Rihanna. It's a beautiful song. Stevie Nicks. But Detroit Rock City is more my speed. Uh, Don't Stop Believing versus Hard Luck Woman. I'll be honest. This one's a little tougher. But again, I'm going with Kiss. I'm going with Hard Luck Woman. And I love Don't Stop. Don't stop thinking about tomorrow. All right, next. You can go your own way versus sure know something. This one was very close. But I'm going to go with uh, Kiss again. Now, here's the thing, Melissa. Uh, me and Dennis, we're both idiots. We don't know what we're... Uh, you know, we love Kiss, you know? I mean, no offense, Dennis, but you're, you're, you're dumb like me, all right? Come on, we're Kiss fans. Fleetwood Mac fans are smarter. Anyway, um, that's why I'm picking all these Kiss songs. <laughs> all right, next. Uh, Hold Me versus Deuce. Again, I'm going with Kiss. Durr. I'm going with Kiss. I like that song more. Uh, Everywhere versus Do You Love Me. And believe me, I like these Fleetwood Mac songs, but I'm going with Kiss again. Is Fleetwood Mac going to get anything? We'll see. All right, next. Gypsy versus I Was Made For Loving You. This I'm giving to Fleetwood Mac. One of my favorite Fleetwood Mac songs, one of my favorite Stevie Nicks sung songs. Absolutely love that song. I bought Mirage. It's on Mirage, right? I bought the album that has Gypsy because of that song. I was made for loving you. I dig it. I used to hate it back then. But I love it now, but no. Fleetwood Mac is on the board, all right? All right, next. Uh, you Make Love and Fun versus Calling Dr. Love. This one was super close because I love Christy McVie's voice. Rest in peace. I was very sad when I heard she passed away. She was awesome. Um, I love her voice. But I got to go with Dr. Love. I just like it more. All right? All right, next. Uh, Dream versus Beth. I love both. I'm going with Fleetwood Mac again. Giving that one a Fleetwood Mac. Next. Uh, Say You Love Me versus Strutter. Say You Love Me is cool, but I got to go with Strutter. All right? I got to go with Strutter. All right. Hey, uh, you all playing along, Melissa? Huh? And Dennis, are you playing along? Am I going too fast for you? I'll slow down. All right, next. Tusk versus Cold Gin. All right, this one is easy. Cold Gin. Tusk. What the hell's up with that song, really? I bought the album, double album. It's very spotty. There is some beautiful songs on there, like The Beautiful Child, was that the name of it? With Stevie Nicks, there is a few gems on that double album that's full of stuff that 
I don't think should have been there. Could have been one album. All right, next. Uh, did I say I was giving that to Strutter? I mean, uh, Cold Gin? Yes, I did. All right, next. Tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. Versus Plaster Caster. Plaster Caster's all right. But I like Little Lie, Tell Me Lies more. Definitely want uh, that one wins. All right, next. Um, Sarah versus Rock and Roll All Night again. And it's not the burnout factor. I just think Sarah is a gorgeous, beautifully written tune. You know, Rock and Roll All Night's fun. I don't hate it like a lot of people burnt out. I'm not. But, you know, come on. It's K-I-S-S. You know what K-I-S-S means? Keep it stupid, stupid. Where I think uh, Sarah's a better team. So I'm giving that to Fleetwood Mac. All right, next. Big Love versus Flaming Youth. All right, this one I got to go with Kiss. And I'm not even the biggest fan of Flaming Youth. I think it starts off great, but when there's circus music, it turns me off. Uh, this love is just too strange. Can't get into it. All right, next. Over my head versus two sides of the coin. All right. What the hell is two sides of the coin doing on a best of album? It wasn't even the single off the album. Ace's song, Talk To Me, was a single. And yet they put this deep track that's terrible. So, yeah, uh, over my head easily. All right. Then we end it with uh, No Questions Asked, which I was very, very surprised with this song. I didn't really know it. I don't know this tune. And uh, I loved it. And that's going against Shout Out Loud, the Shout Out Loud, I believe it was Detroit uh, Tiger Stadium, whatever, the reunion first show. I went out and bought this CD only for that song. That's that, like what I was saying earlier about you and me, Dennis. I mean, come on, man. Melissa's smarter. Anyway, uh, I'm going with no question asked. So, uh, Melissa, happy birthday, and this is the final score. All right, there you go. Again, a very happy birthday, Melissa. I hope you and Dennis enjoyed this track-by-track -track album battle. I hope you played along with me and had a lot of fun. Like, I had fun doing this. This was fun. And plus, I listened to, see... I own, I don't own a lot of Fleetwood Mac, but I do own Rumors. I think everybody owns Rumors, it's a law. I own Tusk, I own Mirage, and I own, I think it's just a self-titled one, right? Don't they have a self-titled album? I don't have none of the Peter Green stuff. I know, it's great. I heard it a million times. I heard the Peter Green stuff. No comment. Ask me on another video, and I'll tell you what I feel about the Peter Green stuff. Let's just say I only own the ones that feature uh, Lindsey Buckingham and Stevie Nicks. Anyway, there you go. Thank you so much, Melissa. Happy birthday, and thank you, everybody that's watching. Please leave a comment. Uh, leave a comment. What do you all think of Kiss and Fleetwood Mac if you're going to put them all together? And wish Melissa a happy birthday. And please subscribe to this channel if you haven't. And uh, click the little notification bell. Like the video for the YouTube agnorisms. And stay frosty. Listen to Black Sabbath. And if you'd like to donate, I got a PayPal in the description below. And smack them a gobble.